Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to show you guys how to play DVDs on your Windows 10 device. Considering that the DVD player is no longer free from Windows 10, it's no longer built in. So in this brief tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how to do it fairly simply. Or I should say very quickly. So we're going to jump right into it. And we're going to start by opening up any web browser. I'm going to open up Microsoft Edge because it's the most convenient right here. And then I'm going to navigate over to Google. And assuming you are already on Google, we're going to type in VLC. And you're going to hit enter. The website domain should say videoland.org. We want to open that up. You want to download VLC. The current version is 2.2.6, but again, that might be different for you guys when you are watching this tutorial. Things usually change over time. And the file at the time of this recording is about 30 megabytes. So I'm going to save. At first, depending on what web browser you're using, it might look a little bit different. Internet Explorer and Edge users should look pretty similar at the bottom of your screen. And then once it's finished downloading, you want to click on Run to run this file. You might need user account control privilege, and you will have to click on Yes to let it install. It's going to begin setting up the installation file. It's going to ask you to select your language. You want to click on next once you finish reading through this. Once you've accepted the end user license agreement, click on next. Click on next again. And it should take a moment, so just be patient here. And OK, it says completing the VLC Media Player Setup Wizard. You want to run the Media Player. Click on Finish. I'm going to click on Continue. And then once you have the VLC Media Player open, you can click on the Media tab at the top left. You can open a disk, open a file, depending on what you were trying to do before you found this video. If you're trying to open up a disk, you can click on that, and then assuming it's already put into your computer, you can just click on play at the bottom and it should start playing. If it was saved on your desktop, for example, you could just open the file and then just find it on your computer. It should not be too hard to find if you guys have ever searched for files before. And then it's pretty simple from there. You can close it out of the window and do whatever you want. And now you have a means of opening up DVD files. So I hope this brief tutorial helped you guys out. And I will catch you in the next video. Goodbye.